A 26-year-old man from Houston was sentenced to 27 years in prison after killing the wrong person. He shot a 24-year-old man down because he thought he was the man that was dating his child's mother. He didn't know for sure. He just thought that he was the one. But you know, in these times right now, that's all you need. According to the reports, he had never seen or met the person that he killed. He had only had a basic description of him. And that description was he was black and he had dreadlocks. And with that little bit of information, he drove from Houston, Texas, all the way to Arlington, Texas, over 250 miles. Listen to me. Some situations we find ourselves in, we have no control over. And this was the situation that this victim found himself in. It was nothing that he could have did different because he didn't have no way of knowing that he was the target. He was just walking through his apartment complex and this man grabbed his gun, got out of his car and shot him down and just drove off. One of the witnesses said, I was on my way in my house and I seen a white Nissan outside and I seen the victim. By the time I walked through my front door, I heard gunshots. And when I came out to see what was going on, I seen the man laying outside on the ground and I seen the car driving off. This man had no way of knowing what was going on. He just minding his own business, just walking through. And you got this angry guy sitting out there in a car waiting to kill somebody that he's never met, never seen before. And they say guns are the problem. I don't think so. I honestly think that if all the guns were taken away from us right now, we'll just create something else to kill each other with because the problem is us. The problem is the way that we think to drive from Houston, Texas to Arlington, Texas without traffic. That's almost a four hour drive. There was plenty time while sitting in that car that you could have just talked yourself out of that. Hey, man, this ain't worth it. Why am I going to kill somebody over somebody who don't want me? If she didn't move 250 miles away with somebody else, maybe she want to be with them. Maybe it's really over. What could this 24 year old who lost his life, what could he have done different? He didn't know that death was on his way from Houston. He didn't know that an angry man in the parking lot was sitting there. He didn't know that. He didn't know about what you and your ex-girlfriend had going on. He didn't know that you just had a description, a black man, dreadlocks. He didn't know you had that. Again, I want to say stay safe, but it's hard to when you don't know where the threat is. You don't know who the enemy is. You might be an enemy to somebody that you never even met. He wasn't even man enough to confront the man, to even see, is he the person? Because they said that they, they said that him and the guy had exchanged words on the phone before. He didn't even have the courage to, hey man, you the dude who I've been going back and forth with? Hey, you the dude that's talking to my... He didn't do that. He didn't do it. He just got out the car and shot him down.